Cinephiles, welcome to Cinephile Game Night, a new weekly series from the film stage. I am your host, Connor O'Donnell from the film stage and the B-Side podcast. And tonight is a very special episode. Uh, we have The Flop House versus The Film Stage, which will be fun. Uh, tonight we'll be playing three games, filmography, movie actor, and six degrees. The winner of each round gets a point, and at the end of the night, the team with the most points will be declared the winner and receive a lifetime of bragging rights and very, very temporary, but great internet glory. Our guests tonight from the Flophouse podcast, a comedy podcast about bad movies, are Dan McCoy, writer for The Daily Show with Trevor Noah and Jon Stewart, and a host of the Flophouse podcast. Dan, how are you? Good. I want to say, uh, I want to point out, a lot of us are wearing hats. <laughs> yes. All the viewers of the at home, I want to say that two of us showed up with hats originally, and then three of us got jealous of those hats and had to put on hats. Which ones? You'll never know. <laughs> it's, a, it's an important detail. Uh, In another game in itself, really. <laughs> basically, basically. Um, also with us, we have uh, Elliot Kalin, writer for Mystery Science Theater 3000, The Daily Show, and also a co-host of the Flophouse podcast. Elliot, how are you? I'm doing great. I have... <laughs> two children that are inside all the time and <laughs> it has been a real education in what I assume prisoners of war have to go through <laughs> <laughs> otherwise doing good thank you for having me thank you for being here we also have with us uh, Stuart Wellington bar owner and co-host of the Flophouse podcast Stuart how are you uh, I'm great uh yeah I'm not sick anymore uh, my bars are all closed so uh, I'm here with you guys <laughs> on, a Saturday, on a Saturday night. Well, thank you for being with us. We really appreciate it. Oh, I'm so happy to be here. Uh, and last but certainly not least, we have Hallie Haglin, a former executive producer on Wyatt Cinex Problem Area on HBO. And she's also a staff writer on The Daily Show and a friend of the pod for The Flop House. Hallie, how are you doing? I'm doing pretty good. Wait, Stuart, did you have the Rona? Did you, were you sick with that? Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I mean, I didn't, I didn't get tested because I'm not a celebrity or an old person, and I didn't have a direct vector. But everything, every symptom matched. I'm finally getting my sense of smell back, which is not cool at all. <laughs> Can I tell you? I think I may have also had it because I didn't have like crazy symptoms or whatever. But the loss of taste and smell has been a thing, and I can't tell if that's just yeah. like. A normal cold thing or if i got it yeah so yeah my my, my my husband in mid-february took a connecting flight uh from china and then he got back okay. and then he got pneumonia <laughs> so oh, no. oh, wow. he had it but like no one was talking about it that yeah. when we were still in new york no one was talking about it being in new york so yeah this fucking rona wow we got it he that's, had it before terrifying. it was cool i get it hallie sure yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you guys know yeah, yeah. Yeah, I still have like I still have some lingering like chest tightness. Like my lungs, like I went for a walk today and my lungs are like, what are you doing? <laughs> Go back to your chair. <laughs> well, hopefully you're on the mend. <laughs> it takes a big swig. <laughs> perfect, perfect time to take a drink, Stu, right after telling us your health is not perfect. <laughs> <laughs> and on that yeah, I'm gonna die it's fine we're all gonna die Ellie it's cool <laughs> uh also here tonight obviously as usual playing for the film stage we have Dan Mecca and Jordan Raup uh the founders of the film stage how are you guys hello just happy Doing to be wearing well. hats Jordan's not yeah. cool he's not wearing a hat it's okay we yep. still only one of us could yep no that was Dan you were the one that started it kind of really that well, was it was spoilers I broke it. I broke it. I didn't, I, I, we gave up the game. I, came on, I, I wanted to wear my Indiana Jones hat, and so here we are. <laughs> uh, and also with us, as usual, we have cinephile game creator Corey Everett. How are you? Hello. Holding up. Uh, okay. And uh, tonight, we're hoping to raise money once again for Art House America. And uh, Jordan, I believe you're going to tell us a little bit more about that. 
Yes, um, Art House America is a fund that started uh, a few weeks ago and uh, with the goal of $500,000 to raise money for over 150 independent movie theaters and their staff uh, during this uh, current crisis. And so they've already raised um, almost 400,000. So they're almost on their way to their initial goal. And uh, yeah, they just announced, Criterion announced today, the first batch of theaters who have been approved for uh, receiving the first amount of the donation. So uh, check it out. Um, there's a link uh, we have here that uh, Dan will throw up throughout the show. And yeah. Yep. Yeah, and just to start it off, you got cinephilegame.com slash game night live to find out more info on Art House America. Like Jordan said, donate, find out more. And let's start playing. And yeah, no, I mean, just, and just a reminder about the donations. If it's a, a dollar, five bucks or whatever, send us a screenshot with the hashtag cinephile game night. And you're going to be entered for a chance to win the ultimate cinephile prize pack, which includes a copy of cinephile uh, and criterion, uh, the criterion Blu-ray of leave her to heaven, Jordan Peele's pieces of us book, Peter Jackson's King Kong production diaries box set. Uh, have yourself a movie little Christmas signed by author and former guest Alonso Duralde. Uh, Rotten movies we love. Uh, also, uh, Beth, the book Best Movie Year Ever signed by author and former guest Brian Raftery. And other swag we're going to be co collecting just throughout the season, uh, including some exclusive uh, Flophouse merch uh, courtesy of tonight's guest, like a poster, an enamel pin, and some vinyl stickers. So please do donate. Uh, obviously, as Jordan mentioned, it goes to a good cause. Uh, without further ado, we're going to start the game. And here to explain our first rules of the game is cinephile creator and Peter Cushing's long lost son, Courtney Edwards. <laughs> Hi. Uh, OK, so the first game we're going to be playing tonight is called Filmography. Um, the object of the game is to name more films by one actor than your opponents. So actors with longer filmographies like Sam Jackson would need longer rounds, while actors with fewer appearances like a David Bowie would be shorter rounds. Um, so how do we play? Uh, one player will draw a card from the deck and read the name of the actor and the film on the card. Uh, and then taking turns, uh, each subsequent player must name another film in which that actor appeared. When a player names, uh, a film that has already been named or is stumped and can't name another film, uh, the next player can name one and knock them out of the game. So basically play continues until there are only two players left. Uh, when one of the remaining two players can't name another film, the other player must name one more to win the round and get the point. If neither player can name one, then the round is a draw and no points are given. Um, the last thing we should say is uh, what is an eligible film? Uh, so an eligible film as defined by the instructions are narrative films in which the actor appears that has been released. So what does that mean? That means that cameos count, but animated films and voiceover appearances do not, um, as well as films that played at a festival that have not been released yet. Uh, so for Alec Baldwin, Boss Baby and the Royal Tenenbaums would not be eligible, but uh, his cameo in Adventures of Pluto Nash uh, would count. Um, so. We've also kind of collectively decided, what's that? If, for, if do CGI recreations of an actor count? Would Peter Cushing <laughs> in Rogue One count? That's a good question. I would say yes. I think, it, I think it's the rotoscoping thing. I think it counts. Yeah, because yeah. rotoscoping, we do count, so. Okay. Well, yeah, but Peter, Peter Cushing uh, is in Rogue One, right? Okay, like, then what if, not to step on it, does Laurence Olivier in Sky Captain in the World of Tomorrow <laughs> count? I don't think so, right? <laughs> If we get I, to that I, point, I, we will. I, love, I forgot to do it. I'm happy to do a case by case basis. Okay. Case what about case. Ben Affleck in Final Fantasy Spirits Within? <laughs> no, that's, that's, that's just an animated movie, right? That's an animated voice. Uh, uh, if it yeah, doesn't right. look exactly like Ben Affleck, it doesn't count. But if it does, then we'll count it. So right. Peter Cushing mm -hmm. would count. Uh, Sky Captain Lawrence Olivier would count. A Anyone in Beowulf, I guess, in the Robert okay. Zemeckis? <laughs> yeah. uh, count it. If, it, if it looks like the actor enough, Mo then cap. sure. Mo okay. cap, yeah. Uh, and with that, if there are any questions, you ask them now. Otherwise, we'll begin the round. Yeah, yeah. and we just to reiterate uh, live for the air, uh, our play order, we're going to alternate between film stage and flop house. So it will be myself and then Dan McCoy and then Corey Everett and then Hallie and then Jordan and then Elliot and then Dan Mecca, and then Stuart. We're going to call it out as we go, so nobody gets confused, but just as a, a general uh, intro to it. Um, 
All right, so I will draw our first card of the night. And our first filmography is McConaughey. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Don't know him. Uh, and I will start with the movie on the card, which is Dazed and Confused. And I throw to you, Mr. McCoy. Uh, the Beach Bone. Corey goes to you. To me, um, I will say uh, The Wolf of Wall Street. Uh, how to Lose a Guy in 10 Days. Great one. Um, Magic Mike. Elliot. Elliot. Oh, uh, Angels in the Outfield. Nice. Oh, nice. To me, oof. Uh, Amistad. And Stuart. Uh, Sahara. Oh, yeah. yeah. Dirk Pitt. A Dirk Pitt entry. <laughs> um back to me i will say um ghosts of girlfriends past uh fool's gold yeah all that fool's gold <laughs> um a time to kill i don't know i i give up <laughs> <laughs> all right yeah. um yeah. i will say serenity oh god yeah i was gonna say serenity. i was gonna, um another matthew mcconaughey movie i'd really put a lot onto serenity in my mind <laughs> what happens you get locked in and you like for yeah, locked in and then suddenly i couldn't yeah. remember it for a moment um Hmm. Now I can only think of commercials he's been in. <laughs> <laughs> you could um, you could parlay that into a movie. Oh yeah, the Lincoln Lawyer. Thank you. Oh my God, Connor! <laughs> wow, wow, Connor you, thank you, Connor. Who who are you playing for? That was nice. Oh, we're, all, we're all friends here. Yeah, we're all friends here. Come on, come on. All right. It's all right. Like, we're, all, no we're, all we're all We're all in the back. We're all right. My turn. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna say because um, I can't think of anything else. I don't know why. He was in Larger Than Life, the elephant movie with Bill Murray, wasn't he? I think he was. I don't know. Is he? Yeah, I believe so, yeah. Um, You're the only person in America who's ever seen that movie, so we have to take your credit. Your, your like mid-90s, um, maybe, Hal, you want to check on IMDb, maybe, if, if you don't mind, if you got your phone there. Uh, what, what is it, the elephant life? It's called Larger Than Life. Elephant's life. I can look it up, because that's not. No, I got it. Larger Than got... Life. Where Bill Murray gets an elephant. Yeah, he like, I think Matthew McConaughey is like the other guy. All I'm thinking of is Operation Dumbo Drop. That's a different movie. Yeah, it's, I know. Similar. It's similar. Right. Elephants were big that year, you know? Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, elephants are big every year. We can keep, yeah. we can keep <laughs> going in the meantime. Uh, yeah, he's in it. Wow. Yeah. All right. Oh, shit. So All right. It goes to you. Of course, I'm going to do the Dallas Buyers Club. Oh, uh, awesome. yeah. Uh, we said fool's gold. Did anybody say regular gold? Just gold. Oh yeah, nope. yeah. I forgot nope. he was Never the director heard of, of Doolittle. All right, uh, Ed TV. Nice. Right. Oh right. The other Truman Show uh, was what Ed TV was. Um, mm -hmm. I will say um, uh, Interstellar. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, back to me. Um, I will say Mud. Oh yeah, mud. This guy was in a lot of movies. <laughs> I, I, I knew them from somewhere. <laughs> All right, Elliot. Uh, was he in Sahara? We oh, said, we said, said it. Oh, we said, we said it. it. Oh, you. I miss. I forgot about that. All right, then I'm out. Then You're out. out. All right, so it goes to me. Beep boop bop. I'm gonna say. I just had it. Shit. Oh, oh, contact. Nice. nice. Yes. Original Interstellar. What up? <laughs> I'm gonna say Killer Killer Joe. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. um, it's not a movie I like, but it's a good one to name in this. Uh, did anybody <laughs> say the Paper Boy? Paper Boy. Uh, paper Paper Boy. Oh wow! And we watched that for the Flop House, and I forgot about it. Uh, I might get this one wrong, uh, but Texas Chainsaw Massacre: The New Beginning. Yeah, that's close enough, right? Is it? Yeah, it's uh, not. I think it's, it's the beginning. It's, 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 it's that's not the name. Yeah. It's next generation. Uh, next generation. Oh. I'll, I'll, uh, 
I'll, I'll call. Him. I'll call it a pass. No, he, it's the first game. He knew what movie yeah. he was talking about. It's the first game. All okay, right. so he's in. He's Dan's in. in. Yeah. Okay, to me. To you. Yes. Um, white boy Rick. Shout out to my sister. I was trying to think of the uh, name of that. That is the. All uh, right. I will say. I. I think I only have one more in me. Uh, Bernie. Yeah. Oh. oh. Uh, and I think it goes to you, Dan. Oh, I'm out. oh, Elliot's oh, yeah. Out. Uh, I'm, I'm not. I, I mean, I'll I'll name something he wasn't in if that helps. <laughs> <laughs> we'll re- there, we'll there is down the list. Oh. I mean. So if anyone was going to say Return to Oz, he's not in that. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to say Failure to Launch. Oh. Yeah. Oh. SJP. In which Bradley Cooper is his best friend. Uh, so Stuart, guys, I'm, I'm gonna have to pass. My brain's totally empty. Right. Um, to which I will respond by saying, "Surfer, comma, dude." Oh my oh, god! Surfer, dude. Terrible movie. All right, Dan. Wait, is all the weight on me for the team now? Yeah. Shit. Yes, yeah. Dan. Oh <laughs> uh, God. Um. God's not going to help you now. <laughs> <laughs> He's busy. Uh, I mean, it's, this game is much harder because he plays the same character in every single movie, pretty much. So true. So I kept being like, all right, let me picture him. And I just picture his face. And I'm like, oh, that, but that's. I also don't cool. think, I don't think there are too many more, actually. There's no, one. There, there's there one that's like pretty. That, pretty big. Yeah. Yeah, there's always yeah, I guess. Yeah, I can't. I'm I think I'm out. All so right. Sorry. Okay. All right. Um it's me? Yeah. Um he's in Tropic Thunder, right? Oh yeah. fuck. That was mine, you fuck. Mm. All right. What do you need? He, less glasses? Is he in um We Are Marshall? He yeah. is. He is Marshall. Marshall. I haven't seen it. Hey. Okay, <laughs> I am gonna say I'm out because I think I'm tapped. Uh, does that go to me? I will say two for the money. Oh, oh. classic. <laughs> <laughs> the exact opposite of that. <laughs> Have you guys covered that movie? Uh, I don't think so. Or Surfer Dude. Surfer Dude's a bad one. No, um, don't even don't do Sur- Surfer I Dude. Think, like I think the last Maddie Mick one that we did was uh, was Serenity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a classic. <laughs> so who? Corey, are you still in, Corey? Corey yeah, still I'm, I'm in, but I'm going to be out. <laughs> I, me too. Just give me just one second. Um, uh, ba, 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 ba. Well, I'm going to go on IMDb. Is it The Wedding Planner? Oh, well, it's certainly, uh, buddy. certainly is in that. Um, certainly is. Damn. All right, you're out, Jordan. I'm no, I'm, in, I'm just gonna say Magic Mike XSL, even though he's right, he's not in it at all, right? He's not in it. Okay, I don't know. Oh wait, there, there's a huge. <sighs> Sorry, go ahead, Connor. Well, Connor, go. Yeah, so it goes to me. I will say the Free State of Jones. Ah, who could forget? All right, Corey. Um. um yeah, there's a few here. Fuck. Honestly, I thought we were finished with him about 10 titles ago. He's had an amazing career. All right, Connor. Corey, you're out, right? You're yeah. out. Um, Lock it in, Con. Uh, okay. Shit. Oh, my God. Come on. Oh, I will say, I'll say uh, Dark Tower. Yes. Yep. Oh, oh my God. God. Wow. So, dude, check this out. Just I'll oh, read a couple and then we'll go. The gentleman. We none of us said the gentleman. Dressed up for so long. Yeah, yeah you could like. Did anyone it. say Rain of Fire? No. 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 That one. Stewart. Come on. <laughs> Fraley. That's your whole Fraley. brand. <laughs> Being the guy who would do Rain of Fire. <laughs> oh. U571. Remember that movie? Oh, oh, I like that movie. Yeah. All right. That's like the mummy of submarine. Boys on the side. I should have known that one. Boys on the side. Good movie. He was the side. He's on the side. In that movie. We, did, we, got, we did get every reconnaissance film, so that's good. That's we good. Did. That's good. All right, so round one to Connor there. McConaughey. Wait a minute. Hold on. 
<laughs> yeah. It's rigged. The game is rigged. Uh, Dan, do you want to shout out our charity before we Oh, thank you. Yes, sorry. Right. So, a reminder, else. we're playing for Art House America tonight. So, please go to cinephilegame.com slash game night live. Find out more information about that great charity, what they're doing for indie theaters, 100, over 150 of them uh, around the country and their staff members during this time. Donate. Let us know on social, uh, whether at the Flophouse uh, social or at film stage or cinephile somewhere hashtag cinephile game night and let us know and thank you and uh let's pick another filmography person as, as matthew mcconaughey would say jk donating <laughs> Corey, are you wearing a suspiria t-shirt i am yes i am also somewhere underneath this wearing a suspiria t-shirt <laughs> <laughs> so many, oh, so many layers are tight. revealed <laughs> so in a way we're on the same team. Hat or no hat, we're all the same underneath. <laughs> Nobody. Is this a star belly sneeches sort of situation? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Some so people wear next, hats. Some people so wear Suspiria shirts. Some people are Hallie. <laughs> Is it's true? Some people are Hallie. Bobby, Bobby, Reddy. Ooh, Bobby, Bobby Red. Bobby Redford. Bobby and I will start with the movie on the card, which is Three Days of the Condor. Uh. Captain America, the Winter Soldier. Classic. <laughs> um, I will say um, Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. Never heard of it. Jesus. Um, um, oh. Uh, indecent Proposal. Yeah. Nice. Uh, I will do um, Old Man and the Gun. Uh, who's next? Elliot. Oh, well, my next. Uh, yeah. All is lost. Yes, yes. And I'm next. I will say movie I watched today: Spy Game. Uh, is it me? Mm-hmm. Uh, what the? Is it the Candidate? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Michael Ritchie. Good movie. Um, I will say the way we were. Uh, Pete's Dragon, the new Pete's Dragon. Um, the sting. Is it Wait, my? It is. is. Yeah. Oh, uh, so it doesn't count if they if they directed it. They have to be in it, right? Have to be. Yeah. In it. Have, have to, to be, be on screen. Yeah. What if I can describe? <laughs> <laughs> if it leads you to the title, that's that. Works. Okay. Yeah. Start describing. Michelle, It'll help us though. Michelle Pfeiffer is Ooh. his counterpart. Yeah, yeah, they get very. Adventures, they like, get very the opposite of social distancing. Yeah. In. It's like another word for near and. It's like the opposite of down. Close. And. Per. <laughs> How you per count? No. Uh, close. And closer. <laughs> yeah. Right. yeah. Yep, close and personal. You got it. Uh, uh, I'll I'll give you the pass. You got it. <laughs> but yeah, up close uh, and personal is like one of the first movies I remember watching on a plane sitting next to my mom. <laughs> that's a really magical uh, time. Yeah. That's a <laughs> magical time. magical memory. Yeah. He he is in Lions for Lambs, right? Oh yeah. He is. Yeah. Is he? Okay. Yeah, he's one of the lambs, yeah. Is that me again? You. It is you, sir. Jeremiah Johnson. Nice. Thank you. Oh, me. Uh, uh, downhill racer. Downhill racer. racer. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm, Stewart. Yeah. I'm tapping out, guys. All right. Um, uh, the Great Waldo Pepper. Barefoot in the park. Um... Out of Africa? Um, it's not my turn, is it? No, you're in, yeah. You're in. Oh, it is? Okay. Uh, he, uh, he's a reporter. And... Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a big one. One of the top ones. Is it primary colors? No. Oh, it, it no. You're in a yeah. slight ballpark, I guess. Close. Um, uh, I don't know. All right. 
Uh, I'm going to skip that one. He does, I believe, briefly appear in Avengers uh, Infinity War. Uh, I think it's the one after. I can have a rule that you can never out, okay. after After Infinity War? Yeah, it's no, it's it's end game. End game. You're out. I had that in my head. I'm out. You're out. You've gone easy. Get out. Get out. Somebody else can use it. Somebody else can use it if they want it. Yeah. Is it my uh, turn? You yeah. Just, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna steal the one Hallie wanted. All the president's men. Yeah. Jordan. Oh. Jordan makes just FYI. Jordan makes that exact mistake every <laughs> time we do this game. He gets a wrong movie. He's like. This one, and it's yeah, he, like, he like calls it his doesn't like, like, like sometimes or fairly every unfair. game, every time. Well, no, Dan, one was the end game, and one was the war. They're they're big, the most. Come on, yeah, yeah. yeah. so different. I feel like uh, like when they go through like all those Planet of the Apes movies, that's where it makes me the angriest because I'm well, like, those hey. are the ones that make the least sense. That yeah. the Dawn of the Planet of the Apes is after the rise of the Planet oh, of the Apes. Yeah. It's so, annoying. It's so annoying, yeah. All right, Connor, it's you. I think it goes or to me. You. Yeah, it goes to you. Sorry, uh, I will say the I'll say the movie that Jordan got wrong. Avengers Endgame. He's in for a minute. I was just teeing it up for you, Dan. You know. Thanks, buddy. Um, I will say sneakers. Damn it! Oh, wait, no, it's not my turn. Yeah, it is your turn. It is your turn. Is it? Yes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Out. Sorry. Yeah, that was I, was, go. I will say sneakers. Oh, uh, oh boy. Um, well, he was in a movie called Oh Boy. <laughs> Dan's got Dan's got oh, a sneaker brain right now. Legal Eagles. Nice. nice. Good pull. Wow. Good nice. pull. Um, bu- 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 uh oh. I'm, I'm blanking. Uh-oh, I'm cap. Spotlight, the glare. It's too bright. He's out. Corey's out. What a loser. <laughs> Just kidding. I love you. So, uh, so it goes to you. Oh, you're out too, Jordan. Right? I'm out. So oh, Elliot. Elliot. Oh, Elliot, yeah. Um, I think I'm gonna have to pass unless I can say that episode of the Twilight Zone where he plays Death. Oh, the so good. it's a great episode. Wait, uh, so does that count even though it's not a movie? It does not count, but it is a good episode mm-hmm. worth calling out. More people should watch it. Thank you. Thanks. I think mm-hmm. I'm a, and I know that because the story was told to me recently that he was supposed to be in The Legend of Bagger Vance. Oh, he directed it. He directed it. Wait, wait, originally wait. It was apparently it was gonna be him and Morgan Freeman. And then really? they needed bigger names. That's crazy. Interesting. Anyway, that doesn't help that it was he was gonna be in it, right? No, certainly not. No. But again, fun trivia that we love to have okay. on this uh, show. So okay. fair. Okay, we- I have a question. Another question about rules. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> what if they were the like a the narrator in a movie? I don't. They're, they're, no, still doesn't count. Okay. You have to see them, see them on screen. That's kind of the dividing line. Mm. All right. Okay. All right, my turn. Dan, right? But like, if we were doing Gene Shepard filmography, we couldn't say a Christmas story. Correct. Because that seems Wait, crazy. No. Wait, it, don't you see him in the movie? He's the uh, guy in line. He's a cameo. Oh, okay. Oh, so that counts. All right, fine. Okay. I'll say that. Cameo count. <laughs> um, old man and the gun. We didn't say right. Oh, wait, do we say? We it? did. Yeah. We did. I said it, Dan. Come on. I made a Jordan mistake. Uh, no. I'm out. Um, so is it just me for the uh, it's such a Jordan move by me just me for the <laughs> film stage um, Connor, it's all on you buddy cool no pressure um, uh, I'm out I got no I I can't I got nothing do I have to what? say something that's correct to win yeah you need one yeah. more one more Dan to win otherwise was he in the horse whisperer? Yeah. Yeah. Congrats. Oh, oh, Lord. Tie game. One Tie one. Game. Well, pass win, Dan. We want to move on to movie actor. Yeah. yeah let's yeah. go ahead and do that. Um, okay. So uh first, Dan, why don't you remind everybody why we're here Thank tonight? You. Sorry, I was writing down the score here. All right. So just a friendly reminder if you're watching, go to cinephilegame.com slash game night live to check out art house america the fun we're playing for tonight find out more about them they're supporting indie theaters throughout the country over 150 of them and their staff members click the donate bu- bu- button give us some cash l- give them some cash let uh let the, us know on social that you did that and uh, thank you so much for watching and doing that and yeah okay, as um, Rob redford would say jk donating <laughs> <laughs> 
His famous catchphrase. Okay, so the second game we're going to be playing well, he was, tonight. He was doing a Matthew McConaughey impression at the time. That's from, <laughs> and that's yeah. from the Horse Whisperer. He said yeah, that. in the Horse Whisperer. Famously, uh, where he's he like the horse is like neighing at him, and he's like, "Huh, Matthew McConaughey would know what to do," and he does an impression of Matthew McConaughey, and the horse is like, "Wait, that was, Matthew McConaughey?" That was the Oscar. Oscar. It's the mistake to make. Yep. He looks right into the yep. camera when he does it too. It's yeah. weird. He whispers yep. it to the horse, and then it yeah. cuts to black. That's the yeah. whole movie. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. so. So the second game we're playing tonight is called Movie Actor. Uh, just like filmography, the object of the game is to be the last player standing. So it's similar, but slightly different to those rules. So uh, in Movie Actor, uh, one player draws a card from the deck. Uh, and this time you read the movie on the card. So in this case, you would say uh, Bottle Rocket. So the next player has to name an actor from the film Bottle Rocket. Uh, they can name Owen Wilson or they can name anyone else in the film. So the next player would say Luke Wilson. The player after that would name a different Luke Wilson movie. Uh, so they would say Royal Tenenbaums and then the next player would name someone else from that movie and on and on. The biggest difference with movie actor is um, if somebody is stumped and they cannot name another movie or actor to get out of it, uh, that player is out and the next player draws a new card to continue the game. So we keep going around minus the players who have been X'd out uh, in previous rounds um, until we reach the end. And if you don't have a deck with you, that's fine. Uh, Connor or one of us can draw on your turn. And um, that's how the game is played. Uh, again, eligible movies are the same as the last round. Any questions before we begin? Great. Um, cool. because Daniel McCoy uh, won the last round. Maybe Connor, you can draw a card and he will begin. Yep, yep, sure. So. The first movie, Rosemary's Baby. Yeah. Uh, so you no. say Rosemary's so that's, Baby. Yeah, that's what you, you say. Don't. And then it goes to Corey. To Corey. And then to me. So I can name anyone in the movie. So I will say uh, John Passavetes. And that goes to Hallie, oh, who I'm... has to just who has to just name any John Cassavetes. Come on, movie. Hallie. Come on, Hallie. You got this. You got this. Mm. Got this. <laughs> if anybody watching the live stream take wants a to guess. comment and 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 just Do help her Nick out, we'll take Cassavetes it. movies. Count? No, that's harder. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the well, a lot of people are in Goodfellas. I <laughs> like <laughs> <laughs> you know. I like the strategy. Just I do love that it. strategy. Like a lot of people are in this one. <laughs> All right, so I will draw a card. Wait, who is he? I gotta look him up. John Cassavetes. It, ca it had to be a fucking. It's old a hard one. one. That's a hard one. That's yeah. hard. It's hard. It's Ellie, hard. Don't it's... humor me. No, it's it really. Not hard Ellie, for... just oh, say no. dirty dozen next time. Just say the no, dirty really, dozen next time. It is a hard one. It's hard. All right, so I am drawing for Elliot. So Zardoz is the movie. So <laughs> that's Elliot. That's uh, you can name anyone, including the person on this card, and. Wait, so, and it's okay. it's my turn to say a person. Yeah, so Elliot, you person. can say you can you say, can say Sean, Connery Sean Connery and be done with your Sean round. Connery, because like, come yeah. on, I yeah. can't remember those English actors. Yeah, yeah. Right, so, so now Sean Connery, uh, Sean Connery to dance dance. Is anything. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm gonna say Sean Connery. I'm going to say the movie Entrapment. Mm, that's a word police use. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I'm gonna say Catherine Zeta Jones. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, to which I will say, um, mm, side effects. Oh yeah, she's holy shit. Uh, Channing Tatum. Sure. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Good guess. <laughs> no, I saw it. I saw it. I just couldn't. Like I could not. No, I know. Just it's a, it's a total I like movie. that movie a lot. Yeah. I, you That's just couldn't remember which you're going to meet white for your team member. Okay, I'll say Hail Caesar. <laughs> wow, thank you. All right, um, I will say uh, Alden Ehrenreich. To Elliot. Oh, to me? Yeah. No. Uh, solo. To me. A Star Wars story. Sorry, I'll say the whole title. <laughs> thank you. Solo. We were all okay. waiting for it, Elliot. Wait, well, because he could have been in Mario Van Peebles solo, you know? Yeah. So it's like. Exactly. You could yeah, be in free solo. We don't know. <laughs> Good point. Sorry, you're right. I got it. The soloist, you know. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, all right. Solo to me, I will say Amelia Clark. Uh, uh, 
uh, last Christmas? Yes, indeedy. Sure. Uh, and that goes to me. Who is the fucking dude <laughs> in that fucking movie? Don oh, oh, that dude. That's a, he is a dude. Is it, I get his name wrong all the time. Is it Henry Golding? Is yeah. It? Okay. Right. To me, Crazy Rich Asians. Yeah. Um, Aquafina. Yeah. Nice. Um, the farewell. Is that me? <laughs> It's a tough one. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. a tough one. <clears throat> Although one of my co-workers is in this movie. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Uh, you say it. With you. His name is Ronnie Chang, though. Right? No. Oh, no, I'm thinking of Crazy Rich Asians, though. We're talking about The Farewell. Right. The Farewell. I was still talking about Crazy Rich Asians. I don't know which your co-workers is in that movie. I know. Is yeah, it... I've texted you about it, but... I mean, Hallie doesn't... My assurance that you would not remember... That made me feel like I wasn't cheating by saying that. Um, <laughs> it was a, a mere tidbit. Um, mm, no, I'm liking on the names of the other cast members. All right. All right. So I draw a card, right? Yep. Okay. So Dan, who is it? Uh, X Mayo. She is after your time, but uh, she is a and delightful Hood? lady who is one of the writers <laughs> now. Okay. So, this is my Goldie Hawn, and the movie is Sugarland Express. You can name the person on the card, Stuart. So I, so I say Sugarland Express to Stuart, and you can say. No, oh, and I'll say Goldie Hawn. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Howard. To which I will say um, foul play. Allie, it's one of my mom's Wait, favorite. I'm movies. sorry, I didn't even Burgess think. Uh, oh, no, it's all good. Burgess I, Meredith. Nice. Oh wow. Okay. Um, I'll say uh, because I just watched it with my son. Uh, Batman the movie. All right. Um, all right, Jordan. That's Michael Keaton, right? Nope. No. <laughs> I knew Jordan wasn't good. I, oh, I, buddy. I have not seen Batman the movie. 1966. My dad would be ah. the person who played Batman in the 60s. Just I know. <laughs> All right. So, uh, Elliot, Elliot, you're out. Are you in? Elliot? You're I'm out. out. I mean, out. I'm out. Happy yeah. to say Stuart, it's Batman Stuart. Do you want me to draw? I can draw for no, some. I draw, right? Because it's it, me. It's Dan's turn and then Stuart. Oh, right, right, right. You're right. Yeah. Can I tell you what my dream scenario would have been there? Is that no. I would have gotten that, or someone would have said Cesar Romero. I would have said the thin man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. would be in my territory. Then we'd be talking about 1930s <laughs> yeah. action. Oh, I thought you were going to say Cesar Romero and you were going to say the computer war tennis shoes. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the movie is Scarface. And uh -huh. it was the Stewart. I'm going to say Michelle Pfeiffer. <laughs> <laughs> um. To which I will say, the story of us. Oh fuck! Tagline to that movie. Oh, they covered the posters. The story of us. Huge stars, Dan. Uh. <laughs> Who's the natural person to be married to her in that movie? Because <laughs> that's not who's in it. There's a story that I, uh, story of us. Fucking A. Whoa. What? <laughs> oh, I looked at that. <laughs> is Bruce so in that movie? He oh, is. Yeah. Wow. Well Wait, what did you say? I was just going to say, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm oh, sorry. yeah. To me, Bruno yeah, Bruno. Um, to you, we'll go to Dan then. Uh, I will say blind date. Blind date to me. Um, I know this. It's a uh, wait. It's Terry Polo, right? No. No. Who is Tim it? Singer. Oh, I'm think. You know what I'm thinking of? Mystery date with Ethan Hawke. <laughs> Sorry. So I'm out. It's the first okay. time anyone has ever thought of mystery date. <laughs> All right, I'm out. Yeah. 
Okay, so Stuart would be next, so I can draw for him. Um, <laughs> awesome. Take them out. So the, <laughs> your film is Election, yeah. and then that would go to Connor. Connor to name someone in that film. Uh, okay, so somebody in Election, I will say uh, Chris Klein. And I will say Street Fighter, the <laughs> legend. <laughs> I figured that's what you would say. Wait, what's it? What's it called? Street Fighter: The Legend of Chun Chun Li, uh, or Chun Lai, whatever. However you pronounce Chun-Li, it. Dan. Chun Li, dude. Charlie Nash. Bangkok, correct. Are you Are you disputing Street Fighter? No, no. no. Chris Klein oh. is amazing in that movie. Oh. Boy, you got this. Come on. I don't think I got this. Give me a second. Oh, come on, man. Bangkok. It's like you've never seen Street Fighter Legend of Chun-Li before. <laughs> I mean, you know Chun-Li it's was so out. much like that. You haven't seen all the Andre Bertoyak movies, dude? Come on, what's your problem? <laughs> I got nothing. Um, You're so out, dude. Connor, it's all to you. Wait, okay. who, play, who plays Chun-Li? I'm out. Oh, <laughs> uh, what's her name? It's the... Christine like Stewart. Half... Asian, yeah, I, you're Kristen Kirk, right? Like, yeah, you're right. It's like just, a big, like, like teen star. I feel like Smallville. Yeah. She was, she was the model line. Is it Kristen Kirk? Kirk? Yeah, yeah. Kirk. yeah. Kirk. I don't know how to say her last name. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, the bad yes, guy the bad guy's movie that everyone's blue like, "Come on, Corey, you got this. Come on, come on." And he's like, "I'm out. Who's in it?" Everyone's like, "We have no idea. We don't know." Right. No, what's his name? Neil McDonough is in it, and yeah, uh, that's who it is. Uh, and Taboo, Duncan. Taboo from the Black Eyed Peas is in it. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. He plays a right. yeah, sure. Um I am shamed. Okay, I'm out. Who's who's next? So it's so weird about Stuart. saying that like she was a half Asian woman. <laughs> I, want make, yeah. just, I want to make it clear that I said that only because I think Hollywood has a trend. Yeah, of there are Asian characters who are played by. Like at best, <laughs> half Asian women. Right. At worst, non uh, people of uh, Emma Stone. Of yeah, yeah, Emma Stone. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Do I clarify? That's why. I'm <laughs> so, yeah, no, uh, it's it's okay. Cord, do you want to draw another card for Stuart? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. So wait. So real quick. Sorry. So Stuart is in. Stuart, Connor, and Dan. No, That's it. McCoy. Not McCoy. Me. Not yeah. you. But, Okay, the film um, for Stewart would say The Wolf of Wall Street. And that would go to Wall Street. And I will say um, I will say Rob Reiner. Oh. Uh, Rob Reiner. That's, um... You know this, Dan? Uh, this is Spinal Tap. Yeah. That's the one I was thinking you would know. Yeah. You put it on Spike Brand Jones. Drescher. Yeah, good one. Um, I will say The Beautician and The Beast. Oh. Gotta do it. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that goes to Dan McCoy. Yeah. Dan. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Oh, that's why I thought you said, ooh, I thought you were, like, excited. Uh, Petition the Beast. That, was that uh, Pierce Brosnan? No. Oh. Other one. Long Which other one? It was Timothy Dalton. Timothy oh, Dalton. fuck. Right. Oh, close. Yeah. Connor yeah. versus Stewart. I picked the wrong one. Oh. Okay, so this is another draw for Stewart. It's down to you and Connor. Uh, the next one is the winner. So uh, the film. Guys, I'm doing really good. Uh, Stewart, <laughs> Stewart will say The Grifters. The Grifters. Uh, <laughs> and I will say, um, we talked about her on the last episode. I will say Angelica Houston. Yeah. Uh, okay, I will say Ice Pirates. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. I'm done. Oh, I'm, shit. I'm done. Oh, I'm done. Two one flop house pulls into the lead. Well done. Great job. Oh god, I, I'm well so done. glad I've watched Ice Pirates so many times. <laughs> that backfired on me in a big way. Congratulations, Stuart. Oh, um, Dan, do you want to tell us who we're playing for, and then we'll do one more. Yes, I do. Show. Sorry, I was just getting over Ice Pirates. Um, go to cinephilegame.com/slash/game night live to find out more about Art House America. 
who we are playing for tonight. They're supporting over 150 indie movie theaters in the country and their staff workers during this time. Find out more, donate, let us know on social that you did at the film stage, at Cinephile, at Flophouse, hashtag Cinephile Game Night. Let us know and thank you. As Great. Angelica Houston would say, because she's doing an impression of Robert Redford, doing the impression from the horse right. for Ben Donahue. Yeah. KK donating. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so I guess we're going to move on um, to the final game of the night. Uh, we'll do a couple rounds of six degrees, and then we'll go back. Uh, if there's a tie or something, we'll do one more round of one of the first two games. So the rules for six degrees, um, the object of the game is to connect two actors through the films in which they've appeared. If you've ever played the Kevin Bacon game, it's kind of a twist on that. So if you were to draw two cards, uh, Joaquin Phoenix and Winona Ryder, you would say uh, Joaquin Phoenix was in the village with Sigourney Weaver, who was in Alien Rex Resurrection with Winona Ryder. That would be two degrees. So basically, uh, two players will each draw one card. We'll read out the names on them. The first player to solve it will say, I've got it. They will tell us the math. And if more than one player gets it at a time, be the player who does it in the fewest number of degrees. If only one person gets it first, you can use up to all six. It doesn't matter. First person to get it unless it's more than one person. Um, any questions? Great. Right. Do you have a question? No. You I just read the eye of the tiger for a moment. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Sorry, I, have yeah. I, I was distracted by something that was happening in my neighborhood. I'll say it. <laughs> Hallie, was it a bird? There are many beautiful birds in this neighborhood. <laughs> what, what is this game we in? <laughs> so we're going to draw two cards and we're going to try and link them together in some right. cases the two cards might be people who are in a movie together and then right. you would say that movie if not you would say this person was in a movie with such and such who was with such and such who was with so this I, under such. I understand that part but but it's like a free-for-all like yeah. whoever free-for-all it will yeah. be someone to say I, I got it and then a scramble for someone to say I've got it and and show us the work so how do people get eliminated? Uh, there's no elimination just one. here. It's just whoever gets it first wins the round. So uh, whoever is in second place is everybody, and everyone will assume you had it also in one more degree. So all we're, right. all, <laughs> we're all safe here. Good. <laughs> OK, great. Um, so because um, we have decks, I guess Connor and I will each draw one card. We'll read the name of the actor or actress on the card, uh, and then first person to get it. Say you've got it. All right, our first connection. Reese Witherspoon to uh, Mark Ruffalo. They were in Just Like Heaven together? Yeah, I think there let's go is. that one a wash. I, I feel like oh, you know, come on. You read, they read the, you read the cards, though. Yeah, you read the cards. I, I feel like I feel like we'll All right, that someone one. else draw. <laughs> Dan, you draw one. I'll draw, I'll draw. I'm, I'm so bad at this game. Here we go. All right. All right, I'll well, draw one. game would be played. So Anthony Hopkins. Anthony Hopkins to Jennifer Jason Lee. Mm. Oh, Anthony Hopkins in Silence of the Lambs with Jodie Foster in Panic Room with Kristen Stewart in Twilight with Robert Pattinson in Good Time with Jennifer Jason Leigh. Wow. Yes. That was a long one. Your I mind forgot, works I very differently was, than mine. Yeah. I forgot she was in Good Time. Yeah. Was, yeah. I forgot that was a movie. <laughs> <laughs> she played the Jennifer Jason Leigh role. All right, you guys want to draw another pair? Sure. Our next uh, connection. Naomi Watts. Naomi Watts. Michael Keaton. And Michael Keaton. Uh, a Birdman. Birdman, yep. You, you got it. There you go. Right? Yeah. yeah. Counts. All right, what's the tally now? Is it? I think we're ahead by one if you don't count the first round, but you count the last. <laughs> so bitter that. Um, yeah, so three to two. Um, do you want to do one more of these? You or, flop yeah. house can sure. choose. What, sure. what game do you guys yeah. like the best? Well, no, no. Jordan, let's oh, one do one more six degrees, see if we can even it up. You know what I mean? Like, That's true, yeah. Okay. Uh, all right, you want to draw a con? Sure. You got this, Hallie. All right. All right, so Viola Davis. Viola. Viola <laughs> sorry, Viola Davis. Thank you. To Jessica Chastain. 
Darren. Help? Hey, no, that was Bryce Dallas. No, you got it. No, no, that's that's yeah. correct. Yeah, that's correct. Right. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, she was the girlfriend. Yeah. All yeah. right. So uh, we're tied up again. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna play one tiebreaker round of either filmography or movie actor, and because you guys are the visiting team, you can choose which game you want to play, and we'll do one last round. What do you guys think? Well, I thought that uh, the game we played before was going to go better for me. <laughs> so you want a second chance? Oh, which one? Well, no, I don't want to get. Well, I want to. I want to play it again, but for me to do better. No, I kind of. I'm inclined to okay. yeah, yeah. myself. So I don't know about you guys. If you got this one, the middle one. Yeah, the one we did in the middle. Movie, there. movie oh. actor. Yeah, yeah, let's yeah, do it. Yeah, yeah, let's do, do it. it. All right, let's do it. All right. Um. So, uh. Callie, since you won the last round of Six Degrees, we will oh, start. Oh, yes, I did. I yeah. seem to remember that. <laughs> <laughs> we will start with you. Um, In the most humble way, too. You, you said it, you're just like, <laughs> great. And your movie is? Punch Drunk Love. Punch Drunk Love. So that goes to me, right? Yes. So, um, yeah, punch Drunk Love to Jordan Ralph. I will say uh, Luis Guzman. To Elliot. Uh, Elliot. To Elliot. To me. Um, Journey to the Mysterious Island. Oh yeah. Is he yeah. in that? Dan. Is he? Oh, to me. Yeah. Yeah, he's Very in that. So. Um. All right. I will say Journey to the Mysterious Island. Uh, and the mo and the actor I will say is Josh Hutcherson. <laughs> That's his name, right? Yeah. 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 It was yeah with yeah. the question mark at the end, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Does no one remember who that guy is? So I think that's how you legally have to say. No, oh, no, no, no. I I just watched uh, just watched the third season of Future Man. He's great in that. Um, <laughs> uh, he's got uh, an amazing neck beard. Uh, I'm gonna say I'm because uh, I'm next, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to do uh, Hunger Games. There you go. Um, and I will say. Uh, Donald Sutherland. Uh, the Invasion of the Body Snatchers remake. Um, Jeff Goldblum. Uh, Earth Girls Are Easy. Yeah. Gina Davis. Is it back on me? Yep. yep. Um, Transylvania 6 5000. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get this wrong, I think, because it's, wait, it's not. Um... I like that we picked Gina Davis's two best movies. <laughs> <laughs> wait, <laughs> Earth Girls are wait, wait. It's not, um, I'm going to get it wrong. It's not Weird Al, right? That's the other movie. That's right? the other movie. That's yeah. UHF or whatever? Yeah. All right, so I'm out. It's Ed Begley Jr., right? Yeah. 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 Begley. Yeah. And then I would have said She Devil, and then it would have continued. <laughs> <laughs> on Criterion, or at least it was a month ago, on Criterion Channel, She Devil. So Dan's out, so, <laughs> so, so Stuart will start with Horror uh, of Dracula. Mm. Oh, what a movie. To Connor. Uh, to which I will say Christopher Lee. <laughs> No, it's I a short film, a filmography. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah. uh, Come on, Dan. Sorry, I, I keep spacing out. Uh, I will go with uh, <laughs> Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers. Okay. Um, I will say uh, Sean Aston. You said Sean Aston, not John Aston. Sean, correct. The Hallie. Who's that? Who's that the Hallie, yeah. Just confusing that he like he gave his son a rhyming name. That seems like a bad. <laughs> yeah. You could keep and you could keep it in the trilogy. Only one yeah. was named. Just yes. Yeah. Just... Sean Astin. So is that the Goonies guy? Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's what he has um, his ID. I'll say Josh Brolin. Is that to me? Uh, yes, right. sir. I keep forgetting the the order things. Um, Avengers: Infinity War. Right to Stewart, right? Does does he look like oh, yeah. him? Yeah, he does. I'm just gonna say, okay, okay. They got mocap stuff all over his face, and it's got. His I eyes. know. All right, all right, Stewart. Uh, you said Avengers: Infinity War. Yes. 
I will do uh, Zoe Saldana. Uh, to which I will say um, Colombiana. Yes, that was in my head. I was saying, Fuck you. I fucking knew you were going to say Fuck that. You. <laughs> who the fuck remembers who's in Colombiana? If, if you knew said the fucking losers, I would have known who <laughs> losers are. But I don't know goddamn one person in Colombiana. I'm sorry. I had to do it. I'm out. I know. All right, Dan's out. Okay, I just, so I will call. Is it wait real quick? It's Vartan. Vartan's in that movie, right? I I have no idea. Is Nobody it, knows. Sure, sure. Know. Vartan's in that. Michael Vartan. Okay, Dan, I'm so sorry, we, I led us down that path. Uh, so both Dan's are out. Uh, yeah. I will draw, and I will say the next card. The film is called Strange Days. Oh, great. And it goes to me. Yeah, and you can say you can say the name on the card if you want. I will say Angela Bassett. Nice. Um, I will say um, Mission Impossible Fallout. I for two seconds, Jordan, I thought you were going to get the title wrong. I thought you were going to say like <laughs> another Mission <laughs> Impossible. That's why I, I, I did it like that. Yeah. Keep on your toes. I'm going to make it tough. I'm going to say. Uh, it's for me, though, dude. Don't make it that tough. Okay, so I'm gonna say Tom Cruise. <laughs> Ooh, tough one. Oh, shit. Gotta figure that one out. Uh, I will do. Man, what movies is he doing? <laughs> uh, I will. I'll just say risky business. Uh, okay, uh, I'll say Rebecca De Mornay, and that goes to me. That goes to uh, yeah. A ham that rocks the cradle. Yeah. To I am literally or sorry to hell yeah. Thought about getting this in a seat. Oh, God. But I thought I would get Rebecca De Mornay and then I would get <laughs> What if I can remember the tagline? A ham that rocks the cradle. Yeah, rules the world. Is a ham that rules the world. Yeah. 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 Oh, God damn. Nobody fam- uh, or so okay, the parents. The, who were the parents who she was the nanny for? They were. It's, it's not Demi Moore, right? No, but, but, um, and there was a guy who care of plants. Wait, so what, say that again? No, I I'm I, I, <laughs> care of plants? Yeah. Dan, you've made it worse. <laughs> the, the mom was in stuff. She, uh, I'm trying to think of a good hint. I can't really. Jennifer, uh, it's not uh, the. And the uh, other guy was in one of the biggest movies ever. Oh. So that would be Jim Carrey. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I will draw for. <laughs> He's named right. after. He's right, right, though. It is Jim hey, Who's Carrey, the biggest right? movie ever guy? <laughs> yeah. Who are you th- Ernie Hudson. I was thinking of Ernie Hudson, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. He, yeah. He's the guy. Character. I don't even I have no, yeah. no idea. The character that, right. they, that she blames everything on. I forgot uh, that he was. Emily only knows him as the as that, dead one. All right. That, about uh, uh, Rachel McAdams. About time. So uh, about time to you, Elliot. You can say anyone in about time. Well, I'm out. I don't even know what that movie is. No, you, you can, can say the it, person on the, card. The, on the card. Oh, okay. Rachel oh. McAdams. <laughs> um, Good thing there's a name on the card. <laughs> uh, to, I said red eye. To oh. me, uh, I will say Killian Murphy. To me, or, um, and, I was, and then this will go to me, Corey, just so you know. Just saying. Oh, okay. Just remember. I, um, I will say Inception. Oh, thank you. Um, I forgot he was in that movie. <laughs> I will say um, Ken Watanabe. I will say The Last Samurai. I'll say my boy Tom Cruise. <laughs> <laughs> uh, to which, uh, this is going to you, Corey, right? Yes. Okay. Get him out. <laughs> 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 sure. 
to win this, Dan. This is, this is for everything. For a good cause. I will say. Are you, right, are you, you glad I didn't say uh, letters from Iwo Jima? I will say <laughs> losing it. Yeah. Oh. Get him out. Wow. Wow. It's not Rebecca DeMorty, right? <laughs> <It's> uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I draw again. Uh -huh. Here we go. Oh, we just did. Here, I'll skip. All right, here we go. Um, Steve Buscemi is the is the name, but it's Billy Madison. Anyone in Billy Madison to Elliot? To me? Yes. Um, I will say, do I want to say someone out of the ordinary, or do I want to say someone extremely ordinary? Actually, I'm going to say Steve Buscemi. A bit of both. I, I will say, uh, I'll, I'll just do uh, uh, Pulp Fiction. Fine. Um, is he? Wait, is he in Pulp Fiction? Yeah. Uh, I'm here. Oh, he's, he's the, the lady. He's the he's Buddy Holly, right? Yeah. Oh yeah. my God, that's right. I forgot yeah. about. I forgot about that. Yeah. Uh, Pulp Fiction, I will say, uh, mm. this goes to Jordan, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, How does it feel hanging come on, out? come on, Connor, just saying. Yeah. Uh, I won't lose it, you. Um, okay, I will say, <laughs> uh, I'll just say Samuel L. Jackson. Was I the only one who had answered for losing it? What's up? Was I the only one who had answered for losing it? Yeah. Who's in losing it, Elliot? Kelly Long's in losing it, right? Yeah. Um, and isn't it Jackie Earl Haley's in it too? He, I mean, he's in everything at that point. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he's a young guy. Young guy. I will say um, Snakes on a Plane. I'm going to say, wait, how do we get to Snakes on a Plane? Samuel. I said Sam Jackson. Oh, Samuel Jackson. Okay. Yeah. Um, so I can't say Samuel L. Jackson. <laughs> and you can't say the snakes. Oh well, I mean, well. What's the name of the guy who goes? Ah, get off my dick when the snakes. Oh yeah, I was just gonna. Oh, it's, 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 it is okay. somebody. I think. I think it is somebody. It is get off my dick guy. It oh, is somebody. Yeah. Somebody uh, who I kind of go to bat for. Actually, I kind of like him when he pops up. Yeah. I feel like he doesn't get enough cred. Yeah, I can't remember. I'm out. All right. Ooh. And snakes on a plane. It's a star-studded cast. You got you got Keenan Thompson. You got Juliana Margulies. Yeah, huge <laughs> stars. That's two stars, Dan. <laughs> uh, or wait, do you want to draw? Yeah, who's up? Draw for me. This Dan, for there's two things I remember in that movie: Samuel Jackson, snakes, three things, and plane. Those what about the uh, <laughs> the Cobra Starship song at the end? <laughs> Rust, Rust and Bone. Uh, oh, so that's to that's Rust, Rust and Bone to me. You yeah. can do. Uh, to which I will say Marion Cotillard. Nice. Uh, I will say La Vie en Rose. <laughs> uh, I, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's Wait, it. That's it. Me right. and Connor. Connor and Jordan, you want to finish oh, it? We, yeah, we, we, we face, yeah, we face we'll, each we'll other. Play it out. We'll, we'll play yeah. it out. We'll play I, I we'll draw. Fix the game. Oh, no, you Connor, draw? you draw. You draw. Right, no, I'll you draw, because okay. it's your turn. Yeah. Okay. Cushing. Oh, shit. Um, All right, Peter, yeah. Peter Cushing. Corey's okay. dad. Corey's dad, Peter Cushing. Um, I don't even know where that came from. It just, like, came out of my mouth when I said it. Um, he would love that. <laughs> um, uh, uh, a New Hope. Star Wars A New Hope. All right. Um, Harrison Ford. Um... Connor, come on, dig deep. Get to yeah, no, I know, I know. I'm thinking. I did this for you, so you can just put me out of my misery. Um, dog movie. I will say, um, uh, what's a fucking deep cut? Um, come on. I will say, uh, Force Ten from Navarone. Fuck yeah! What's up, dude? Um, that is um, Faye Dunaway. <laughs> Shelly Long, bro. Everybody knows. Yeah. No, Jackie. Jordan said it was such uh, a good no, Robert, Robert, you to force 10. Which one? 
Who brought you to Force 10? I spaced out. What was Harrison Ford. Harrison Ford. Oh. oh, Force 10. <laughs> yeah, so, no, 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 no. In my head, I was thinking about Guns of Navarone. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Just the, like, sequel. Who, no one who wanted, or, like, <laughs> who's in Guns of Navarone? Guns of Navarone is Gregory right. Peck and... Uh, right. Who else is in it? Uh, Anthony Quinn, so, I think, is in it. I've, it's funny. I was saying this in the podcast. I've seen Force 10, but I've never seen Guns, which is so weird. Guns, oh, is, Guns is so much I know. Better. I've heard it's great. <laughs> oh, Force weird. 10 is like Ferris and Ford's <laughs> all weathers. Yeah. Well, Alex, I love this. I love that you're forced to like, like you're friends with like me and Stuart and Elliot already, but like then like it's like doubling up on the nerd. Yeah, it's like, like gremlins. <laughs> like gremlins. Would you have been Sorry. better off if if I had gotten Harrison Ford? I would have said the Frisco Kid. Would you have been yeah, better off with that? Yeah, Wilder. Yeah, no, I would be out. Okay, we did, yeah, that's a that's a weird movie. All right, and that's the game, everybody. That's it. Okay. Thanks so much for coming. It was so great having you guys. Um, Let me just Corey. Yeah. All right. One final reminder as we wrap up: just go to cinephilegame.com/slash game night live and learn about Art House America. Donate, let us know on social. Um, and Corey, take it back. Thank you so much. Yeah, uh, thanks again for coming to the Flop House. That was so much fun. Um, we're doing this twice a week to try and raise money for various good causes while everybody's trapped inside. Um, uh, we're doing this again on Wednesday um, with Tomris Lapley uh, from uh, RogerEbert.com and Variety and Time Out New York. She's a great friend of ours. And then um, Rodrigo Perez, who founded The Playlist and is a film critic, um, will be joining us then. And um, thanks again for tuning in. And thanks, you guys, so much for coming. Thank you. Thanks, Great. guys. Thanks, yeah.